was two years ago at this Anderson Target, Denise Garrison received the scare of her life. According to her lawsuit, when Garrison's eight-year-old daughter exited their vehicle, she picked up a syringe that was laying in the parking lot. Instinctively, the lawsuit says, Garrison swatted the needle away from her daughter and was pricked in the palm of her right hand. Garrison sued Target and late last week was awarded $4.6 million to the surprise of Garrison's lawyer. I didn't even suggest any huge numbers to the jury. Attorney Josh Hawkins says they tried to settle the case out of court for the sum of $12,000. Just enough to pay for medical expenses and missed work, but Hawkins says Target refused. We felt like she was entitled to more than $12,000 because of how sick she was and what she had to go through. But because of the uncertainty of trial and because of the costs associated with, with trying a case, we were trying to let everybody get out for a reasonable, amount, a reasonable amount of money. And Target just took a really hard stance on it. I mean, they pretty much said no. A Target spokeswoman told WYFF News 4, we disagree with the outcome of this case. Target is currently considering post-trial motions as well as appeal options. Even Hawkins admits when it's all said and done, his client is likely to receive less than the $4.6 million she was awarded. But he says the fact that a jury awarded her far more than she ever asked for has put large retailers on notice when it comes to safety. Tim Waller, WIFF News 4, Anderson.